The mission to kill bin Laden was run from CIA headquarters, and the man in charge that night was Leon Panetta. It was Panetta who described events as they unfolded to the president at the White House. For an interview for 60 Minutes, we asked Panetta for an insider's view of the plan to get the man that they codenamed Geronimo. Was there ever a notion of capturing Osama bin Laden in this mission? Yes, there could be a, poss a, a, a situation that would allow them to, uh, to capture him, then they were to make use of that. Where were you going to take him? We would, uh, you know, we, we clearly were going to move him out and, uh, and put him into uh, a, a detained area for a while while we uh, obviously interrogated him and then, then made the decision as to what would happen. The president and several others are in the Situation Room down at the White House. Are they listening to you? Are you narrating what's happening? I'm basically uh, briefing them on kind of what's going on. They, they, they're also following it, but uh, I was basically relaying what I was hearing from uh, those who were conducting the operation. What were the exact words that you heard from the SEAL team? Uh, the, uh, the person who was uh, heading up the uh, operation uh, basically said, uh, you know, I think we have a Geronimo. Uh, and I kind of looked around at everybody at, uh, at Operations Center and said, I think it looks like we, we may have, you know, Bin Laden really was there. And uh, then he said, uh, came back, uh, you know, we think we have a Geronimo KIA. Killed in action. That's correct. What was the scene in the Operations Center of the CIA at that moment? Well, you know, it, it wasn't like uh, we were high-fiving. It was more like, uh, frankly, uh, we kind of looked at each other and said uh, all of the work that had been done, uh, all of the questions that had been raised, all of the risks that had been uh, talked about, uh, that, you know, that in the end it had all proven right. Two months after the raid, Panetta moved from the CIA to the Pentagon as defense secretary. 